how's it going guys welcome back to the channel i hope your day is going nearly as well as mine beautiful sunset there today we're going to be driving the c5 corvette that i promised to review Ooh, starts off all nice and pretty air conditioning on nah we'll lose a little power we'll sweat our balls off first impressions of the corvette so far it feels very long and low to the ground which is definitely a good thing especially for a sports car definitely different than my mustang it is a welcome improvement however the interior is also kept very clean my dad actually owns this car if you guys did not see my previous video where we put the new wheels and tires on this corvette as you guys know this car is basically stock other than the wheels and tires put on it i can almost promise you that this car will definitely get an exhaust it's my dad's car, so it might not be the loudest exhaust in the world, but it should sound good. Anyways, we will get some exhaust clips of the stock exhaust even. What is this guy doing walking over here? What the hell? Let's go find us a nice curvy road, and I'll see you when we get there. All right, some more about this car. If I did not say it already, this is a 2000 C5 Corvette. Unfortunately, it's an automatic. Uh, so it would be quite a bit funner if it was a manual, but there's not too much complaining here I'm still enjoying myself. It's quite a bit of bumps in this road before we come to the twists and turns and It's handling them pretty well I Believe this car has 80,000 miles on it and it still runs real good Here we go. We're coming up to the first good corner here. nimble through the corners a bit of body roll with the stock suspension which is to be expected it does do a better job than my Mustang through the corner that's for sure you feel a lot lower and a lot more planted which is always welcome in a sports car if you guys can't see there's a heads-up display right in front of me it is absolutely wonderful and I totally wish I had it in my car another comment on the turning as I'm going through the turns the seat bolsters are holding it me in very well must compliment them on that very good for some 17 year old seats we seem to have caught a utility truck so I'm gonna find a place to maybe turn around up here. Or maybe I'll just let this guy in front of me go ahead. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that actually. Let's try a zero to 60. Ooh, tires off the line. Ooh, a little chirp in this second. There's 60 and some. If I'd have to guess, that was in the high fours or low fives for my 60 time. Ooh, having a lot of fun in the corners with this car. It is so much fun. Quite a bit of oversteer, I must say. I think too much oversteer and you might bite your head off in this car. It handles well for a 2000, but it isn't very refined. Still a joy in the corners. And we've caught up with these guys again. All right, well, let's go ahead and turn it around up here. As for the turning radius, not so good. A couple of bolt-ons and exhaust and maybe an ECU tune could do wonders for this car. However, I'm pretty sure all it's going to get is an exhaust. Wow, it is beautiful out right now. 
we'll go through these turns one more time and then I think I'll mount you up to the exhaust so you get a little glimpse of what the car sounds like I can't get enough of this thing through the corners it is so fun Woo, hard on the brakes heads up display let me know how fast I am going that will be cool if you guys can see the heads up display in the video all right, and I'm gonna find a spot up here and I'm gonna mount you guys up for the exhaust. And then I think we'll uh, wrap this video up. Pray for me, this GoPro's on well. These uh, Corvette bumpers are uh, very plasticky. thing to say before I do end this video you can really feel the top end speed of this Corvette compared to my Mustang now I think I think I'll beat this car to 60 maybe 80 maybe to 100 anyways guys I think that's gonna do it for the review on the 2000 C5 automatic Corvette very good car to buy um, you can probably find these online for about the good for a good fourteen, fifteen thousand dollars for a good one. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed this one. Once again, this one is an automatic, has eighty thousand miles. Does not seem to have any issues. Thank you for watching. If you're stopping in for the first time, leave a like. Subscribe to me, Cam the Car Guy, and have a nice day, guys.